Services are over. Let's go. Anything today? Nothing. Thank you. Anything today? Nothing. Thank you. I can't go on, Joe. I'm weak from hunger. As soon as we get a job, I'm going to take you to the swellest restaurant in town. Oh, How about it, Nellie? Has Polycuff got anything for us? We're desperate. Well, it just so happens he is looking for a face. And a sax. <laughs> right. Right. You got to be under 25. We could pass for that. You got to be blonde. We could dye our hair. And you got to be girls. We could. No, we couldn't. Mr. William Morris. Wait a minute. You mean this is a girls band? Yeah, that's what he means. Good old Nelly. I could wring a neck. I'm holding a... How'd it go, girl? Oh, you. I ought to wring your neck. Please, Jerry. That's no way to talk. Nelly, baby, what are you doing tonight? Tonight? Why? Because I've got some plans. It's a 25 Hupmobile Green Coupe, sir. It's over here. Want some gas? Uh, yeah, about uh, 40 cents worth, please. Put it on Miss Weinmeyer's bill? Uh, yeah, why not? You two toothpick. Come on! Hey! Chambers! Goodbye, Charlie. No, Spats, no! No, Spats, please, no, no! All right, come on out of there. Come on. Come on, Jerry. Wait a minute. Where do you think you're going? Urbana? It's about 100 miles from here, so don't... You're not going nowhere. We're not? Take care of those guys later. Wabash 109A. Joe, we gotta get out of town. Maybe we should grow beards. Or we something. are getting out of town, but we're gonna shave. Shave? Shave. At a time like this, those guys got machine guns ready to blast our heads off. You wanna shave? Shave our legs, stupid. Shave our legs? What? Hello, Mr. Polyakov. I understand you're looking for a couple of girl musicians. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Rosella, move along the doors, will you? Trombone? Hey, Olga, hide your back. Trumpet. Uh, well, here we are. Are you two from the Polyakov Agency? Yes, we're the new girls. Brand new. Hi! I'm the bass fiddle, just call me Daphne. Hi! My name is Josephine, Sag. Yeah. Hi! Welcome to No Man's oh, Land. Oh, thank you. You'll be sorry. <laughs> Take off your corsets and spread out. Oh, well, I don't wear one myself. When I was a kid, Joe, I used to have a dream. I was locked up overnight in a pastry shop, and there was goodies all around. There was jelly rolls and mocha eclairs and sponge cake and Boston cream Look, pie so and cherry stupid. tarts. Listen and... to me. Huh? No butter, no pastry. We're on a diet. Oh, yeah, oh, sure, Joe. I don't you think I'm a drinker. I can stop any time I want to, only... I don't want to, especially when I'm blue. We understand. All the girls drink. It's just that I'm the one that gets caught. Story of my life. And put a little heat under it. Hello. 
running wild, lost control, running wild, mighty bold, feeling gay, reckless too, carefree mind all the time, never blue, always going, don't know where, always showing, I don't care. When I was a little girl on cold nights like this, I used to crawl into bed with my sister. We'd cuddle up under the covers and pretend we were lost in a dark cave and were trying to find our way out. It's <laughs> <laughs> very interesting. <laughs> Anything wrong? No, no, no. Sugar? <laughs> Here. I'll try the instruments. Oh, thank you, Daphne. Oh, thank you, Daphne. Isn't she a sweetheart? Oh, pardon me, miss. May I? Help yourself. I'm Osgood Fielding the third. Cinderella the second. If there's one thing I admire, it's a girl with a shapely ankle. Let me carry one of the instruments. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Aren't you a sweetheart? What kind of a girl do you think I am, Mr. Fielding? Oh, oh please. Please, it won't happen again. I'll say. Please. Oh, well, listen, doll. Uh, what time do you get off tonight? Why? Well, I'm working the night shift, and uh, I got a bottle of gin stashed away, and uh, when there's a lull... Don't you think you're a little young for that, Sonny? <clears throat> Dirty old man! What happened? I just got pinched in the elevator. Well, now you know how the other half lives. Look at that! I'm not even pretty! They don't care, just so long as you're wearing a skirt. It's like waving a red flag in front of a bull. It's lovely out. Yeah, well, let us so. Come on. <laughs> Don't get burned, Daphne. Oh, I've got suntan lotion. Well, see, she'll rub it on me. I'll rub it on her. We we'll rub it on each other. Bye-bye. <laughs> Oh, I'm terribly sorry. My fault. You're not hurt, are you? I don't think so. I wish you'd make sure. Why? Because usually when people find out who I am, they get themselves a wheelchair, a shyster lawyer, and sue me for three quarters of a million dollars. You own a yacht? Which one is it? The big one? Certainly not. With all the unrest in the world, I don't think anybody should have a yacht that sleeps more than 12. I quite agree. How's the stock market? Up, up, up. I bet while we were talking, you made like $100,000? Could be. Uh, you play the market? No, the ukulele. And I sing, too. For your own amusement? Does that mean you play that very fast music, uh, jazz? Yeah, real hot. <laughs> oh, well, I guess some like it hot. I personally prefer classical music. How about that guy? Yeah, look, Daphne, hands off. I saw him first. Sugar, let me give you a little advice, dear. If I were a girl, and I am. I'd watch my step. If I'd been watching my step, I never would have met him. Tell her I'd like her to have a little supper with me on my yacht after the show tonight. <laughs> Got it. Supper, yacht, after the show. I'll tell her. Just the two of you? What about the crew? Oh, that's all been taken care of. I'm giving them shore leave. <laughs> Well, fat chance. Call him back and tell him I'm not going. Well, of course you're not. Oh. I'm going. 